Hello guys, welcome to the course of Docker Deep Dive. In this course, we will learn deeply that how to containerize any application. In this course, we will follow this book which is written by Nigel Paulton. It is easily available on internet. Let's talk what was before the containerized application. In the ancient times, there was a concept that only one app will be deployed on one server. There were two reasons for that. The number one was unable to judge resource requirements and number two was different infrastructure and dependencies. Like some app were requiring Windows and some Linux. That's why we had to use different server for different application. If we talk about instant strategy of deployment of app, there were so many disadvantages. The number one, it was very costly because separate server for each application. The number two was its maintenance. Number three was more big management to manage servers. Now if we talk about modern ancient times of 1998, VMware company was established in 1998 and provided different applications for virtualization. They made a software named VMware which was able to run different applications on same server through virtualization. There were many benefits of VMware. Number one was multiple apps on single server. Number two, different operating system and dependencies on same server using virtual machine models. Save lots of resources. Imagine separate server for each application and single server for many application, which is cost saving than the ancient one. But still there were disadvantages like operating system consumes lots of resources. Now imagine a machine running a base operating system to run virtual machine software and that software running four more operating systems and those operating systems run in different applications. And those operating systems requiring same amount of RAM, hard disk space and much more. Oh damn that poor machine. And the second one is licensing cost of every OS instance. We saw a picture on previous slide in which we saw that we have a base operating system which runs server or on that server we install multiple guest operating system through virtualization. Between this operating system there is a layer called hypervisor. What's its job? Well, a hypervisor is a function which abstracts, isolates operating systems and apps from the underlying computer hardware. This abstraction allows the underlying host machine hardware to independently operate one or more virtual machines as guests. Okay, today we talked about bad old days. In the next video, we will discuss about containers. Until then, thanks for watching and see you soon.